Sometimes it's so important, I feel, to step out of the routine and really challenge yourself. We are in Tokyo. I had a dream to come here and learn from this very rich and mind-boggling food culture. Then came the idea, why don't we simply close the restaurant and move the entire team, literally everybody. The menu that we have here in Japan, it's a menu that's made to last here and only here. Scandinavian and Japanese culture is so different. If we could adopt the eating habits of Japan back home, and also the sense of omontenashi. Omontenashi is a sort of altruistic hospitality that permeates all layers of society. Tsukiji Fish Market. You should come early in the morning. And by early in the morning, I mean early in the morning. Go have sushi. Go eat ramen and hear 40 fishmongers slurping noodles. Spend hours just watching fish in all shapes, sizes, colors. And it's really a must if you like food the slightest. A challenge I think people should take on the next year in their kitchens. Simply look at whatever vegetable you have and just tell yourself, I've just paid 100 pounds for this. Because that changes the way you're going to cook it. It's a never-ending place, never-ending city, never-ending amount of restaurants. To me, it has inspired so many things already. It's just simply a must. <laughs>